Join us as we head to Mackinac Island for the Lilac Festival, June 5th through 12th. And remember, on Mackinac Island, there's no motorized vehicles allowed. In Wausau, Wisconsin, we'll explore the Monk Botanical Gardens at your leisure. You'll find over 30 acres of carefully designed and landscaped gardens that will be blooming in glorious June colors. At the Wisconsin Maritime Museum, you'll have a chance to see a fully restored World War II submarine. Following lunch, you board the SS Badger. Lake Michigan is a majestic lake. For so many people, they've never been on a body of water where they could get out of sight of land. It's especially interesting to see people that have never seen Lake Michigan, and they just can't comprehend the size of it. There's times when the water just takes your breath away. It's a four-hour trip across the lake, so we offer a variety of things for people to do. We have a gift shop, we have movie theaters, we have two restaurants. I think it's just the excitement of being on a boat that size. The Badger is truly an icon. The morning of day three, we cross the stunning Mackinac Bridge. Be sure to bring your camera. You'll arrive in Mackinac City in time for a delicious lunch, some free time before we board Shepler's Ferry, which will take us to Mackinac Island. Famous Mackinac Bridge, you'll experience the thrill of traveling over the third longest suspension bridge in the world. All season long, Mackinac Island is serviced from both Mackinac City and St. Ignace by three ferry companies, Arnold Transit, Shepler's Ferry, and Starline Ferry. Each has their fleet of time machines, high-speed vessels that can take passengers from port to island anywhere from 16 to 30. Virtually every mode of transportation is available to visitors as long as it doesn't require gas. You can stroll, take a hike, take a horse-drawn taxi, or rent a bike. Remember, you've gone back in time when life was a little slower and much more relaxed. You'll get around just fine and maybe even begin to wonder why those crazy carriages with their combustible engines were invented in the first place. When you spend the night on Mackinac Island, you'll see stars you've never seen before, both in the sky and in our wide variety of clubs and bars. That's because nightly entertainment takes place all over the island. Create your own midnight mood with a soundtrack of classical music, big band, folk, rock, jazz, blues, whatever your pleasure. But don't forget the sounds of freighters, waves, foghorns, seagulls, and the ever-present clip-clop of your favorite residents that fill the night air too. Grand Hotel features an array of live music throughout the hotel, including the Grand Hotel Orchestra, delivering hot jazz in a cool setting nightly. Nighttime on Mackinac Island, when you can experience the fun of the island from end to end, literally. You see, here on the island, where there are no cars, it's the perfect place to engage in one of the more fun events of Mackinac Island, strolling down Main Street, listening to the music, sounds and laughter emanating from the restaurants and pubs and choosing the one that suits your mood best. Think of Mackinac Island as an all-natural theme park. Shopping, eating fudge and Fort Mackinac take center stage. Fort Mackinac has been a family favorite for decades. See reenactments, tour hands-on exhibits and relive what our soldiers have experienced since the 1700s. The most comprehensive way to see Mackinac Island is to take a Mackinac Island carriage tour. You'll see and learn all about the island in the comfort of your covered seat from a knowledgeable and friendly driver. Mackinac Island is 80% parkland, so when you head out of downtown, be sure to hike on seemingly endless miles of forested state parkland. Bike on a postcard-perfect coastline while admiring dramatic geographical curiosities all along the way. How about hopping on a horse from one of our stables and going for a ride through the woods? When evening comes, dance beneath chandeliers to big bands or rock out with live bands. Enjoy an evening cocktail and dinner. Take a leisurely moonlit carriage ride or do absolutely nothing at all. Sit, collect your thoughts, unwind, and listen to the timeless sounds of shimmering waves gently lapping on shore. Relax and rejuvenate on the island where time stands still.
All the fun and excitement of Mackinac Island can really work up your appetite. So, when it comes to grabbing a bite on the island, there's something for every occasion and palate. From the historic hotels with their breathtaking views and their world-renowned chefs, to the quaint little eateries that offer something quick and comforting, like a slice of pizza or a juicy burger. It's a safe bet. Mackinac has something to satisfy your appetite in the most delicious way. So, when exploring the island, don't forget to also explore our wide range of restaurants. We think it's one of the nicest ways to capture the flavor of Mackinac Island in the most literal sense. On day five, we board the ferry, leaving the beautiful Mackinac Island, and go to St. Ignatius, where you'll enjoy lunch and a visit to the Point Iroquois Light Station. You'll enjoy a guided tour of the historic sites, and the day concludes with the Sulox boat tour and dinner. Enjoy a wonderful evening on the beautiful St. Mary's River and experience the Sulox, Sugar Island, and sightseeing along the shores of Michigan and Ontario. As your journey home begins, you'll explore the Menominee Heritage Museum, learn about the lives of fur traders, immigrants, loggers, Indians, and more. At the Air Venture Museum, you'll see historic airplanes, flight simulators, and hands-on exhibits. You'll return with the sweet smell of lilacs in the air on our Mackinac Island Lilac Festival. June 5th through 12th. 